mates pretty much introduced me to the game. As a young kid growing up, everyone's sort of playing footy in the area and sort of just got involved through Morty Bray. Under nines, um, down in the bottom oval, uh, I kicked my first goal and I remember it pretty clearly. It was snapped from the boundary. Yeah, I'll always remember that probably. That's my first and earliest memory. I'm a competitive sort of guy growing up with two brothers and I sort of transformed that into my footy and I'm always you know, trying to go up against the best bloke or you know, I'm not going to back down to anyone and I think that's something that if you brought to an AFL club would be pretty advantageous. He's a classic utility type who can play half forward, midfield and across half back. Um, fantastic character too, really like his personality. He's a ready-made AFL footballer. Um, I think my strengths are my spatial awareness and my athleticism being able to play both ends of the ground and I think that's a little bit unique in this year's draft and could hopefully um, stand me aside from a few of the other boys but yeah, it just depends on the day which clubs likes you. Pendlebury has no one in the square. Go the, way. the captain strolls in. All class, Scott Pendlebury. I like comparing myself to Scott Pendlebury. Um, he played basketball growing up and sort of I like to consider myself pretty similar to him. A state high jumper and also a state basketballer, Holly Belly. Played junior basketball at Sandringham Sabres, under 16s. I think 2012 I played with the state team um, and we won a gold medal which was pretty exciting. Yeah, that's about it pretty much. I stopped playing bottom age Dragons and yeah, definitely at the start it was a little bit hard, um, you know, leaving your mates and that whole sort of scene but, you know, I haven't really looked back. I'm, yeah, really grateful for the position I'm in. Well done by Bellic, just to keep control of it and then evade the tackle. Fiorini back to Bellic and they worked that out nicely. Yeah, the drafts, you know, so close and it's pretty exciting and nerve-wracking at the same time but more exciting I think just the opportunity to get your name called out would be yeah, a huge thrill. When recruiters started first coming over me and the family were really nervous and we just sort of wanted to put our best foot forward and mum would clean the house and have lollies out and whatnot but um, yeah found it a lot better um, you know going through the year and I've gotten a lot better at them and yeah, using the same answers now as a lot of the questions are pretty similar. Just clears the kick over to Ballack, who's got some room. I've had a wrist injury from pretty much the start of last year and it's been ongoing, but you know, it's such a big year it is, you don't want to sort of you know, trust your chances just from having a good bottom age year. And um, yeah, I sort of just had to play through injury and play through the niggles of the year and string together a few games. And yeah, I was fortunate enough to do that and then ended up getting an operation just yeah, a few months ago now. Surgery went well, and yeah, the main goal is to have day one of pre-season and you know be on my feet.